Hello everyone, it is Jen Tender here and welcome back to my channel. Today is my first ever vlog. Yes, I am so excited to take you guys along with me. I am going to be seeing the Super Mario Bros. movie, so I'm going to be taking you guys along with me, rating the movie, giving my thoughts and opinions, as well as eating some Mario-ish themed foods. So I hope you sit back and enjoy the video. So before the movies, I decided to make some Princess Peach Strawberry Sando. In every Mario game, Princess Peach always has a strawberry shortcake or she's always talking about this cake or one of the maps in Mario Party is always a Princess Peach birthday cake. So I figured I don't have the ingredients, so I'll just make a strawberry sando, which is basically like a strawberry shortcake sandwich. It's really, really easy and simple to make. All you need is whipped cream or make homemade whipped cream milk bread like the one you see me using right here. Put that on the bread. And then of course your strawberries. I should have probably cut those in half. And then adding the rest of the whipped cream on the top. And then you have to make sure you fill in the whipped cream everywhere so we get a good sweet bite everywhere else. And then I'm just gonna saran wrap it. And this is gonna be a perfect snack for when I come back from the movies because it does need time to chill. So I'm gonna set that inside the fridge and say goodbye to it for now. And then I'm gonna hurry up and get ready for the movies. So I am on my way to the new Super Mario Bros. movie. We only have about 20 minutes till the movie starts, so we are kind of rushing, even though we are going 30 miles per hour. <laughs> Gander with Xander is gonna be seeing the movie with me, thank goodness, because I definitely don't want to see it alone, so. You made it sound like it's dangerous. <laughs> you know, I really needed my security guard with me. We're watching this Mario <laughs> movie. So when Bowser comes on, I get really scared. But Chris Pratt and Jack Black are playing the characters, so like, how amazing is that? Donkey Kong's in the movie too. I'm talking about the voice actor. Oh. You think there's an actual Chris Pratt in the movie? Actual Donkey Kong's in the movie. You know, the real, they got the OG Donkey Kong. Yes, he's trained. They, they paid him a lot of money to get him to stop throwing barrels for a day. I know, so like, where's the zookeeper? Oh man. <laughs> They're like, we will pay you 5,000 bananas. They're like, okay. <laughs> Talk to my agent. I am so excited. I have my hopes pretty high, so ecstatic. I cannot wait. Imagine the movie sucks. <laughs> Don't You're like, oh, the movie was really terrible, but you know, it's okay. It's still Nintendo. the light up screen it just says screen five of paper paper mario <laughs> All right, so I am back. I just saw the Mario movie. It was so freaking good. Like it was like like a 10 or an 11 out of 10. Like if you guys have not seen it, go hop on it, go see it right now. And look, I even got a refill on the popcorn. It's so nice. So I love the bucket. It was totally worth it. Everybody was on brand. Everybody was wearing shirts and costumes and everything. So it was so worth it. Like go see this movie right now. It was so amazing. All right, so now that we're back home, our Princess Peach themed strawberry sando should be ready to be eaten. It's been chilling in the fridge for a few hours now. So I'm going to unwrap it, make sure I cut off the crust carefully. Unfortunately, I got a strawberry there. Here's the moneymaker shot. One of the strawberries accidentally fell out, but it's okay, I just popped it right back in. And there it is, our Princess Peach strawberry sando. I swear it doesn't look the prettiest, but I promise it tastes so, so good. I should have definitely cut the strawberries in half. I was rushing, so I forgot, but every single bite was absolutely delicious. So it decided to rain, so I decided that this was perfect cozy weather. So I decided to get all cozy and cuddled up. 
grabbing some popcorn, putting it in the microwave, and then getting some sweet tea in my new Mario cup, as well as using my new Super Mario Bros. movie bucket, pouring in the popcorn. Then going back to my room and my desk to enjoy watching some videos on my laptop. And while I was sampling some popcorn, I ended up watching some Super Nintendo World videos because the movie made me think of how much I really, really want to go. So I was just watching videos of eating at the Toadstool Cafe because I really, really want to try so much Mario food there. So I just finished eating dinner and I'm feeling so calm and relaxed and it's really, really cold outside. It's still like 50 degrees. I think even now it's probably like 43 degrees. So this is perfect gaming time. And if you saw the movie, Princess Peach looked so awesome on this one. So I'm gonna pick all the bells and whistles she did in the movie. Got her bite, got her glider, everything. So we are just going to be doing wave four as Princess Peach. I would do Donkey Kong as that is my favorite character. He is the OG, but no, we are sticking with Peach because she surprised me in the movie. Oh no, please let me make it to first, please. I'm so close, but I'm so tiny and small. <laughs> Mimicking. I will take that considering how difficult these maps were or this difficulty was. I just got finished playing some Mario games and they were super, super fun. I had so much fun, but even though it's late, I'm really craving something sweet. So I'm gonna go to the kitchen. I made some Mario-ish themed dessert. So for the Mario themed dessert, I actually made Bowser paletas, which are basically mengoñada paletas with a little bit of cucumber at the bottom to look like his shell. So the way I made this dessert was basically just a standard mengoñada recipe. And then I just, of course, blended up some cucumber to make it look like the shell portion of Bowser. And then of course, putting wooden popsicle sticks inside the molds and then popping that into the freezer. And then there you have it a bowser themed popsicle this is what i feel like they would most likely do at nintendo world just making things look themed like nintendo food and yes i'm one of those people that likes to bite paletas it tastes good so it is currently raining it's like what day is it i can't even it's the day or two no it's, it's right friday there we go <laughs> today it's friday yeah it's currently raining and it's the end of the week but i really like the mario movie we both really liked it it was hella good. Yeah, we were shocked at how funny it was, how many references, but one thing I decided is I really, really want merch. Target always has like a good gaming, so, oh my goodness, so rough roads. This ain't no rainbow road. <laughs> <laughs> but I really, really want merch, and Target always has like a good Nintendo section, or they haven't recently. They had this beautiful Mario backpack with the plaid pattern that I really wanted. I didn't have enough money to buy it at the time and I have not seen it since. I regret it so much. Hopefully they have a good selection of merch at Target and even not, we always have to look in the Nintendo section and guess what other area? The Lego section. The toy area, but you know, Legos are there, but I'm super excited. I'll take you guys with me in Target and hopefully we can see a good Nintendo selection. Fingers crossed they have a good selection there. Oh, 
Bubble tea is so good. Oh, uh, bubble tea is so good. Now, time to go to Target. Mm -hmm. Finally in Target, let's see if they got the merch. This is sadly all we're working with. Oh, the Amiibos. I already have a Luigi one. Can you grab that? I wanna see if that's a Yoshi right there. The black um, butt. Well, I was way off. What is this thing? It's is the it Pelican. It's from um, Animal Crossing. Oh, okay. And you dropped Kirby, look. He's... Looks like he's falling. <laughs> Ooh, I love this rainbow one. However, I do not like wired remotes. It has to be wireless. I really, oh, they have Blanc on here. The more I see the OLED, the more I want to like own it. Is there a monster truck in this game? Mm-hmm. I don't know if it's on the demo though. Mm. Used it too early. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh, I got him too. Mm. hard being this good all the time. There's your stats. Yeah. Oh my gosh, they got the Super Mario, Peach's Castle. They actually have like the bad Mario stuff. They got, what are they, guys? They got Yoshi, Mario on the half pipe. Oh, they really do have lots of Mario sets. They got Minecraft too. Is Wonder that a plunger? Mario. It actually comes with a plunger. Oh, I love this. Little race cart sets. There's a Goomba. This dude, whatever his name is, Ligma. Kamek. Ligma. They had at Target that was worthy was the toys and stuff, but that stuff was so expensive and they didn't have a lot of peach. So maybe next time, I guess I'm just gonna have to go on Amazon, but now we're walking to Best Buy. This just looks like they threw a bunch of stuff. Blue shell. When you gotta put that friend in their place. Oh my god. When you gotta humble that. your friend. <laughs> Oh, I love, what is he carrying? Oh. <laughs> Here's the Nintendo stuff. They don't have much though. So I just finished coming back from Target and Best Buy. As you can see, there was so much merch, like toys, Legos, and little things. I wish I could have got some, but they were kind of expensive. But we overall had a good time. Yeah, yeah, definitely, definitely. Since I am home and still craving dessert, I am going to have a Bowser bowl. I swear this mango really does look like Bowser to me. So I'm gonna cut up some mango and oh my gosh, it looks so, so pretty. Scoop it out. And then of course I need my coconut bowl to put it all in. And then I'm going to be adding some chamois for the lava portion, which I feel like this is exactly what they do at Nintendo World. They just make food that looks like the characters and then put a price tag on. And then of course adding tahin because I always like it a little bit spicy. I like a salty and spicy. And there we have it, our little fire lava Bowser bowl. So I'm just gonna take this back to my room and watch some videos such as the new Peaches song by Jack Black. I absolutely love it. It's so catchy. I have been singing it nonstop since. Then afterwards, I just decided to play my 3DS. I have been loving my 3DS. I just can't seem to put it down. I'm constantly playing it all the time. All right, so that concludes the vlog. So about the Mario Bros movie, I honestly rate it a 10 or an 11 out of 10. It was honestly one of the best movies I've seen all year next to the Avatar. And I really, really enjoyed it. Even my brother loved it. 
So one of my goals is to find some Super Mario Bros merch, like some clothing, cause I really wanna rep the movie. And speaking of products, I definitely have a few things to say about the stuff I bought at the movies. So with the popcorn bucket, I definitely think this is well worth it. I mean, it looks so cool. I love how it has all the logos on it and I like how it's super huge. I definitely can't wait to use this when I watch movies or my shows. So I highly recommend you pick one of these buckets up when you go to the movies. So with the cup, I would honestly say it's a 50-50. I really do like it. I think it's vibrant and has all the colors and the characters and it's very amazing, but it does not come with a lid and I don't wanna have to search one out and find it because that's another added expense. I don't really feel comfortable having an open container like this next to my monitor and my Switch. But nonetheless, it is still Mario, so I do love it. I'm just gonna have to be very, very careful when I use it. But I overall love the products. I mean, they go so well together and they're super cool to have. So that is it for my vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please comment down below and let me know what you thought of the video. And if you enjoyed the video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. It really, really helps me out. Join the Gentendo gang because we are a very cool community out here. Also, comment Comment down below and let me know if you saw the movie and what you thought about it. I would love to read your thoughts and opinions. But thank you guys so much again for watching. I can't wait to see you guys in my next one and take care. Bye-bye.